This video is sponsored by BuyCheapMuckCoins.com. Make sure you head on over there for all your Muck coin purchases. Use code GS5 for a discount at checkout. What up, what up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jesse. Welcome back to another Madden 15 online rank match. And today, we have the Saints going up against the Browns. And the Saints are all the way down to an 81 overall. I was like, whoa! Whoa! They got Drew Brees! They got Breezy! That right there alone should warrant an 85 minimum. But nonetheless, man, we're going up against the Bronson. To my surprise, our opponent did not go with um, Johnny Manziel. He decided to uh, go with Hoyer. And, you know, typically you go with the speedier option. It's a move! And thankfully, we actually uh, end up recovering that, putting us in prime position to go ahead and score, which we do on the first play of that offensive drive. Being able to score just like that beautifully, that is wonderful. I wish I could do that more often. So, again, man, we are um, up 7-0, and again, we're back on defense. And um, he actually did a very good job frustrating the living hell out of me. He did a good job, very good job of... Uh, protecting the quarterback he blocked eight like every is that the computer as i'm looking at it wait a minute wait a minute. I, did the computer throw that pass wait a minute is he not even controlling the quarterback i just noticed that now he's not even controlling the quarterback wow i literally oh my god i <laughs> literally, i literally did not even notice that until now He's not, he's not controlling the quarterback. I li I didn't even notice that while I was playing. He wow. Okay. Wow. Now I feel now I feel stupid on uh yeah. He's what? I can't believe I like all jokes to I my son's life. I literally didn't realize this until now as I'm looking at it. Um cuz as you know you're editing, you're not paying attention. But he wow. I just remember in a game that he blocked like seven every single time. So it was tough to get pressure in on him. And when I didn't, when I came out in like, you know, regular coverage, uh, he had extra, extra, extra time. So uh, it was a little rough. And now that I'm looking at it now, he did not control his quarterback. Wow. Okay. This video should be interesting. Uh, I'm shocked. I am shocked at what it is I just discovered here. I'm, I'm shocked. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so we're up 10-0, uh, 10-7 here. And um, I, hopefully he doesn't do that for the rest of the game, man, because that's embarrassing. Look at He's not even controlling the quarterback, man. Wow, and I was struggling. I was struggling. He's literally controlling the running back and blocking. That's what he's doing. He's letting the computer control the offense. And I am struggling. Wow, I feel so ashamed. I feel so ashamed. At the fact that this guy just, that was his offense. And not only that, he had a decent record. He was like 42 and like 30. And I get, wow. Nonetheless, he throws an interception to Robinson. I, I feel disrespected. I feel disrespected. The fact that the computer was out here throwing dots. And I was thinking to myself, yo, this guy, he's he's uh, he's coming in on me, man. Like, um, he's throwing dots, man. I can't, he's blocking seven every single time. And, and I never picked up on it. Until now, unbelievable. unbelievable. Nonetheless, man, the video must go on. So uh, we're trying our best to see if we can sneak our way into field goal range. Uh, you know, he's playing a quarter set right here. Uh, I think it was like cover two, uh, some type of cover two with like the D lineman coming. Uh, it must have been dime where the D lineman goes into a QB spy. So fourth to three, fourth down swagger tree. Y'all know how we roll, man. Just punt the ball. He's going to go on ahead and fair catch that. So we go into halftime, uh, 10 to 7. And you know what? My mindset would have been completely different if I paid attention during the game and realized that he literally just let the computer control uh, the offense. I I did not. Wow. I know I keep bringing it up, but wow. When have you ever seen that? I've, I've personally, I've never seen it. I've never, I've never seen somebody control the running back, block every play, and just let the computer just wow. Nonetheless, man, uh, right there was a beautiful, beautiful punt right there, which uh, pins him somewhere around the thirty. So that right there was a big punt right there. He is blocking again. Uh, the computer just, <laughs> I, I look at he's just blocking. He's doing a masterful job at picking up these blocks, man. And 
Uh, I may have to try this one. Oh, there he is, actually controlling the running the QB. But uh, he let look, look. He's he's not controlling anybody. He's not. He's just controlling the. the I've never seen this before. I've never. Have you guys ever? I've never seen this before. I'm stunned at the fact that I've I I can't believe I didn't notice it. You know, I, again, I've I've never. Oh, there he is controlling the punter. Uh, have you guys ever? Leave it in the comment section. Have you guys ever seen anything like this? Where he's just not controlling. Right here, look at this. So, so Joe Hayden can't catch up. No, 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 there you go. There you go. Use, use uh, Coaston as a shield. Use Coaston as a shield. As we end up scoring a touchdown, going up 17 to 7 right here. And again, here we go back again on defense. And he is still controlling the running back, letting the uh, offense be ran by the computer. And uh, like literally every single play. Uh, again, I've, I've never seen anything like this. This is crazy. And uh, one th again, one thing I did notice is the fact that uh, he blocked a lot, you know, because he, he literally never ran off for a route. Like, you know, he just stayed home and blocked along with the tight end. He was blocking so many people. And um, that is just one thing that I noticed. It's like, you know, typically you don't see that unless you start causing pressure. You know, maybe if I get a sack or two. Oh, now he's actually controlling the QB. He's like, forget you, Hoyer. Uh, uh, you got benched. Uh, so he pulled. Oh, no, never mind. There he is. He must have uh, forgot to lock in on his cube on his running back as uh, he almost uh, picks up a first down right there. So third and six decides to run the ball. And, uh, yeah, he's not controlling the running back. And, uh, again, he's not controlling the running back either. He's, he's – oh, there he is. There he is. It's go time, baby. It's go time as we drop an interception right there. So second and ten, there he is again picking up the blitz. I will tell you what, this guy is a blitz picking up machine. He is picking up every single block that he is supposed to be picking up. This man blocking – scheme is absolutely look at him look at him picking up these blocks man this guy is a block picking oh well he kind of missed that one towards the left but nonetheless uh, the computer scores on this right there man and and i feel like wow anyway i'm i'm sorry i know i keep bringing it. i'm just legit shocked at the fact that uh I, I never realized it i never realized it during the game i legit never paid attention to it at the fact that he was controlling the running back the entire game Again, one thing I did notice is the fact that he was just blocking. Again, like I was saying, um, once you start sending heat, then you, you know you'll start seeing people make adjustments. Like uh, if you start blitzing me and, and uh, you're getting you know free guys in, then I'll start you know trying to prepare with blocking extra guys, tight ends, running backs, whatever it is I got to do to try and you know uh, give me some extra time. Uh, he was doing that from get go, just you know picking up blocks and allowing the computer to run his offense. And again, he's his record. He's you know. 12 games over 500. I mean, he ends up losing this game, but he was still like 12 games over 500. And I don't know if this is how he runs his. Oh, there he is finally going on the route. I don't know if this is how he usually runs his offense, but uh, nonetheless, man, uh, actually, he throws a dot right there. And we actually get a uh, tea bag right there by Josh Gordon. Again, he goes deep up top, the last play of the game, and we end up banning that down. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. We come away with the victory. And yeah, in all my years of Madden, that's the first time I've ever seen that. Wow. Uh, it's your boy GS, and we're going to be signing out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.